but my number one choice is Essential Anatomy 5. This app literally has everything on it anatomy related. Here you can see all the body systems on the far right and there is a male and female version. But if you wanted to see the bones, you could come into the bones and click on, let's say the body of the sternum or the scapula and see these bones isolated and where they are at. Now want to isolate it even more, take away the rest of the skeleton and you can see every single view of the scapula. But if you're done with just bones, time to add some muscles. And I use this app a lot with muscles and not just the top layer of muscles, but the deeper layers, the intermediate layers, you can see lots and lots of layers that you can add and take away. Now, if you want to highlight a muscle here, we can see the rectus abdominis highlighted as we add on all the layers of muscle. Now, one downfall to this app is it doesn't really separate upper, middle and lower trapezius or if a muscle has some higher level details to it, it doesn't really specify that, but it does a great job of showing you the different muscles and the layers. But what I really love is you've got all the systems. So here is the blood vessels, the cardiovascular system. We've also got the nervous system, all the nerves in the body. One of the toughest things to learn in anatomy are nerves, connective tissue, respiratory system, and you can angle it and look up into the actual lungs themselves and then zoom in from whatever angle you want and see the respiratory system. So a really good part of this app is the versatile nature of it. The 3D movement or movement is awesome. Now here's the digestive showing everything, but you can remove things like the greater momentum to see the deeper structures of the digestive system. So I really, really love this app. I think it costed a little bit. I bought this so long ago that I can't remember if it cost money or not, but it's a great investment. Even if it is, I think it was about 30, $35 when I bought it, but something that if you are a medical student, a health and wellness student, you will definitely want an app like this moving forward. And here I've put on all the different systems to complete the app. All right, on to number two here, the iMuscle 2. iMuscle 2 is great for muscles. So this app is specific for muscles, doesn't really do the other systems, but what you'll notice is this one actually has the ascending middle descending parts of the trapezius. So a little bit more detail than that other app. So I would highly recommend having both the first and second app to see the muscles and the body systems. This one you can't remove as many muscles and you can't see the finer details, but again, no app is perfect. I definitely can see you having multiple apps. Now here is the final one I would suggest, my number three, it's called Muscle and Motion and it's gonna give you videos. For example, the infraspinatus muscle, it shows you where it originates where it inserts it's got kind of this fun animation going on here with the hammer but my favorite part about this app is showing you the motions and the action so here's the action of the infraspinatus external rotation you can't beat it this also has an area where you can go in and look at different muscles, but again, not as detailed as those other ones. All right, that's been my top three. Thanks for watching.